Namaskar and uh, very good morning to all of you. The First Lady of the Republic of Korea, Her Excellency Kim Jong Suk, the Queen Mother of Bhutan, Her Majesty Ashi Sange Chodan Wangchuk, Minister for Textile of the Government of Bangladesh, our Minister from Uttar Pradesh, Shri Siddharth Nath Singh, Chairperson of the UP Institute of Design, Srimati Kshipra Shukla, Excellencies, Officials of the Indian Council for Cultural Relations, other dignitaries, experts, ladies and gentlemen. Let me first of all extend a very warm welcome to all of you at this first international webinar on Weaving Relations, Textile Traditions, organized by the Indian Council for Cultural Relations in collaboration with the Uttar Pradesh Institute of Design. Let me at the outset extend a very deep sense of gratitude towards our Honorable Prime Minister of India, Sri Narendra Modi ji, for his very, very motivating message. For a strong texture of relationship, one requires horizontal threads of emotions and vertical yarn of thoughts and principles. What is woven out of these, ladies and gentlemen, is the sturdy cloth of mutuality that helps us unfurl the flag of fraternity. With his message, Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi ji has shown us the path and I am sure all of us can in a very resolute manner walk on the same. We are grateful for the presence of uh, First Lady of Korea and also the Queen Mother of Bhutan. With such a galaxy of leaders, I am confident the deliberations will be qualitatively far more enriching. Ladies and gentlemen, we are organizing this webinar in commemoration of the 150th birth anniversary of Mahatma Gandhi. Gandhiji was not just an apostle of peace and non-violence. He was a strong advocate of economic independence through self-reliance. In Gandhiji's worldview, the idea of freedom struggle was not just about establishing self-rule. It was also about the quest for self and thereby striving for true self-dependence for the larger good of the humanity. Its struggle against colonial rule in India inspired several freedom movements across the world because of his very strong commitment to universal human values. Ladies and gentlemen, it is this commitment to universal human values of non-violence, peace and mutual prosperity that is in fact going to weave international relations in the days to come. Regimes may come and go. Countries may harp upon huge infrastructure projects and may try imposing them while with a straight jacketing approach on others. However, commonality of cultural moorings and strong bonds of emotional relationship for centuries together cannot be overtaken by any ambitious infrastructure project. We believe that textile provides us the foundation for a strong multidimensional relationship. It, encompass, it encompasses culture, traditions, artisanship, entrepreneurship, design and above all aesthetics of a very very high order. Friends, we at the ICCR, the Indian Council for Cultural Relations, are confident that a new fabric of friendship and fraternity could be woven through these day-long deliberations that we will be having all through the day today. I must thank the Uttar Pradesh Institute of Design for their partnership with the Indian Council for Cultural Relations and also to the Khadi and Village Industries Commission and other organizations and other dignitaries and experts who are participating in this particular international webinar. 
once again i extend a very warm welcome to you all thank you very much